All right, let's get back to it here. Links one between now and nine o'clock. Still light to moderate to heavy snow. Heavy snow is going to be in the North Metro roads, slick and hazardous. And then from nine to noon, it just gets a little bit lighter. The roads will get a little bit better. And for the afternoon, we're above freezing, and the roads get a lot better this afternoon. But they're still going to be slushy and yeah, still some problems, especially in the North Metro into Kingfisher and Logan counties off into the afternoon because they're picking up more snow. Road conditions, slick and hazardous, where you see the purple on the map running from western central into northeastern Oklahoma, up into northern and northwestern Oklahoma as well. Cowboy cam, there you go, I-44. Oh, look at Guthrie, it's coming down. And eh, there's been a couple of folks out and about this morning, not many, here in Oklahoma City. Light to moderate snow continues. And there's your snow, folks, running from the Great Lakes and Chicago and St. Louis all the way through Oklahoma. The darker the blue, the heavier the snow, and this will begin to get lighter and lighter over the next several hours. But right now, folks, this is heavy snow, Stillwater, Guthrie, Kingfisher, and I mean it is blitzing up here right now. Where you see the light green to dark green, that's moderate snow, light to moderate snow across the city. Snow now picking up in Seminole and Holdenville and Wetumpka. But look at that snow now across the metro. It's moving east at about 25 miles per hour. Not much snow in Anadarko, but from Binger to Geary to Okarchi to Guthrie. See that orange where Val is? It's blitzing right now in Guthrie. Back to Kingfisher, now moving back into the Edmond area. Look at the yellows beginning to enhance across the city. That's moderate to heavy snow now increasing across the metro. And that's going to ramp up here. But again, it will get better. Lace, what do you think? Well, I just looked at their snowfall rates, David. The radar estimates five inches per hour where Val is. That's moving. It's moving at 40 miles per hour. But if that were just sitting in yeah. one spot, that's how heavy the snow is coming down. And you nailed it up to three inches of snow. Look at this shot from Crescent. Russell sent this to us. He said it's just south of Crescent near the river. This would be called Crescent Springs. Two and a half inches of snow and still very heavy in that area. Keep your pictures coming. 405-645-76. Zero five. I know I'll go back to it. David's like, who is that? It's a little slightly different what's happening right now. <laughs> Thank you. I know. I like to show myself with the picture behind me. It's just the way we do things. <laughs> Keep your pictures coming, please. It's better than a shot of him, isn't it? All right. Anywhere from one to two inches of snow is what we've picked up so far in central Oklahoma. An inch and a half up in Okarchi. About an inch, inch and a half. Closing in on two inches now in south central Oklahoma. But your pictures and your reports help tremendously. So keep those coming. An inch of snow in northern Oklahoma. Now there are a few areas out near Woodward, Arnett, Cheyenne, where you got a half of an inch or a Dusting. Temperatures are in the 20s right now. So the kiddos are waking up, chomping at the bit to get outside and play in this. We will start to see melting over the next few hours. But right now, the wind chill is the factor, especially south of I 40. Winds are gusting 30 miles per hour. It feels like the single digits and teens. So make sure you are bundled up, layered up from head to toe, and prepared for the conditions. Winds do start to back off through mid morning into the afternoon, and temperatures will climb back into the 30s. So one to two inches in the light blue. You're done with the snow, by the way, in the far northwest, and you picked up about an inch. In the darker blue, that's where those heavier bands are setting up, one to three inches of snow with a trace down to the south. Now, a little bit of freezing rain and sleet down to the southeast. There'll be a few areas in south central Oklahoma. Could pick up a tenth, maybe two tenths of an inch of sleet. Snow is a story here in the metro. 100% chance with flurries into the afternoon, but roads get better. Temperatures warm into the 30s, some 40s in the southwest. And this storm system, the main wave, is still out over Arizona. Look at it spin there. As that moves by, tonight skies will clear and temperatures will warm in, or drop into the teens, but warm to the 50s tomorrow. 60s coming up on Sunday. And look at the 70s next week, guys, with heavy rain. Back to you.